Here inside the Woody Hayes Athletic Facility, Stephen Means and Drew Gillis. Nathan is doing a story somewhere. He's still with us. He's just, you know, doing his job. We're doing our jobs, too. We talked with Kyle McCord today. We've been talking, Andrew, a lot about what his special trait might be and how calm he can be in those moments. He kind of took us through that third and 19 call and just how he was inside that. What did Kyle McCord have to say today? Well, he said he was calm. Uh, you know, he, he talked a lot about kind of what that moment was like. And, you know, we talked a lot about just kind of that play call. And I actually thought Emeka was more enlightening on that situation than, than Kyle was because Emeka talked about it and he said that they they run through that play every Friday, but you don't get a chance to execute that play. You don't get a chance to rep that play a lot, especially in a game where the, the stakes are that high and the magnitude is that high. And Emeka said, you know, frankly, I don't remember it because in that moment you're just kind of playing. You're not thinking, you're not worrying about anything, you just kind of play. And, and Kyle kind of said the same thing. So it was just one of those moments where, you know, Kyle, he going in, he felt he had something to prove, and, and he kind of thinks he did that on that last drive. And, and that was kind of the thing that I took from that was it is noticeable to the coaching staff, and it was noticeable to everyone that for all of training camp, for all of the offseason, when we talked to Ryan Day, it was, what does Kyle McCord do that is so special? And he mentioned he just stays even keel. He's very consistent. Everybody in the country saw that on Saturday night. And, and I think that that really kind of shined through when you look at a quarterback who can lead his team down. Because, again, you make that fourth and seven throw, then he almost throws a pick. And he, he, Kyle McCord joked that, you know, hey, he couldn't repeat what he said on the field because that fourth and seven interception, or excuse me, after the fourth and seven, that first down, that would have just been an ugly way for him to end the game. But for him to rebound, for him to make that play, you have an intentional grounding, then you throw to Emeka. It's just really impressive. And I think, you know, that kind of shined through, especially when you talk to Emeka, just how impressive Kyle was on that drive. He said he was the most calm person on the offense. I asked him afterward how much of that is his preparation because he brought that up a lot, just going through some of the stuff, working through some of these plays, the films that he does. He says it's a little bit of both his personality and his preparation. He says he's been meeting with a mental wellness coach that's also been helping with some of that and helping him stay calm in that situation. But I, I think it's – I asked him when's the last time he was rattled, and he said maybe middle school. Yeah. I mean, the guy's 21 years old now, so the fact that it's been almost 10 years since he's been rattled. And I asked Emeka Buka, who used to live with him, when have you ever seen him not so even kill, not so calm? He said after the game, when he was talking his stuff a little bit, which if you go back and rewatch the broadcast, you do see that. It's something to keep an eye on throughout the season because Emeka Buka brought it up. There's two more top 10 opponents left on their schedule with Penn State at home and then going up to Ann Arbor at the end of the season. And so – we talked about it a lot. What are special traits? Justin Fields had his special trait. Dwayne Haskins had a special trait. C.J. Stroud had his special trait. The first time we really got to see Kyle McCords come alive was in that Notre Dame game and how calm he was with, what, about a minute and 30 left in that game, and he, he leads a game winning drive. They're going to need that a lot more this season. It's going to be interesting to watch that grow. Get the text, 614-350-3315. We were texting all types of information as we were talking with Kyle McCord, Emeka Buka. I think we got Cody Simon as well. In this, and get Buckeye Talk wherever you listen to Buckeye. You can listen to podcasts.